Hello everybody, this is Rob with AMZ Advisors and in this video we're going to go over the steps in the process for assigning a registered agent to your brand registry account uh, within the Amazon brand registry platform. So this is useful in case you're, you're working with a third party consultancy like ours where you need to give access to the brand uh, instead of giving them, you know, your credentials and your login information, you can assign them as a registered email through whatever email address uh, that is desired. So here we are at the homepage here. If you just go to brandregistry.amazon.com, this is where you'll start off. Click the home and, and here we are. So the first thing you're going to want to do is hover over the support tab and then go down to contact brand support. From here, you're going to use the update your brand profile option and then from here you're going to do fix issues related to user roles so after this you're just going to fill out this quick form and we'll go through this uh, real quick right here so use this form if you would like to update roles for user accounts that have access to a brand and register and brand registry you must be either the first person who registered the brand or have been designated as an administrator for the brand to submit this request so that just means if you set up the brand registry you're good to do this if you're logged in through that email or if you're someone who's been designated as an administrator, you can do this as well. So there's three different roles that you can assign administrator, which is someone who has full permissions, uh, a rights owner, uh, an individual who has the rights or an employee or a registered agent, which is what we're going to do today, which is a third party who is authorized by the rights owner uh, to report violations. So the only thing we need to do here is fill out this form. It's pretty quick and pretty simple. We're just going to say add a registered agent. And then down here, we're going to use add. And then you're going to put in whatever desired email address. I'm not actually going to submit this. So I'll just put at AMZ Advisors. And then you're going to enter your brand um, that the request pertains to. And this is going to be a case a case sensitive input to your brand registry. So however your brand is enrolled in the brand registry program, if it's all caps or if it's all lowercase, or if you have a couple of capital letters at the beginning of some of your first words, if it's title case, whatever it is exactly on the brand registry, that's what you need to fill in here so that they can match it up properly. All right, and then the next thing you wanna do in this one is assign the roles, which will be one of the three roles that we just kind of discussed up top. So we'll, we're gonna do registered agent, as if we're allowing a third party to come in and, and gain access. So then what you can do is you can put your email address in there so that they could notify you. And it will usually take about 12 hours, they say, well, once you click the send button here. So you can click send once this form is filled out. And that's basically it. So I hope that helps. Again, Rob with AMZ Advisors. If you guys have any other questions or needs concerning your Amazon seller account, we are a full service consulting agency. So you can check out our website and you can book a call with one of our experts and you know tell us about your problems and we can figure out how to help you solve them. And you can also look at our YouTube channel, just AMZ Advisors, if you want to find some more how-to videos and other interesting podcasts and longer form conversations, all that stuff is available. So if you guys want to like this video and subscribe to the channel, that definitely helps us a lot as well. Thanks again. Bye-bye.